So in here, whenever we go to this collision box, it will go to next level, right? But it goes to the next level very fast. We don't want it to be like that. So we should change some stuff. If you didn't watch my last video about going to the next level, you can watch it. It's easy. We just learn one node that is called open level by name. And we can open whatever level whenever, wherever we want, right? And no, we want to fade out. We don't want it to happen fast. What we can do? There are some nodes that we can do it and I will show you the best one in here. Just drag and drop from here and in here just search for camera fade. Okay, so a start camera fade. Okay, this node, the node that we need. First of all, it need to know which camera. For getting the camera, the target player controller. Not this controller, not player stat, get player controller. There is another one. Get player controller inside game player, get player controller, right? This one. And it will give us the player camera manager. And with this player camera manager, we can fade it out. Next option is from alpha to alpha. We want it to start from zero to one, for example, right? And the duration, let's just put one in here, one second. And the color, I wanted to leave it at black, but you can change it to whatever you want. And at the end, the hold when finished, when we fade out our camera, the view of our camera, we want it hold it there until we switch to another level and we go to the another level. So check this. And after that, let's just disable this. I don't want to connect it like this. So just with that, if we run our game in here, if I go to that collision box, let's see. You can see it takes one second to fade our camera out. Okay. So now after that, we can have some, a delay in here, a delay of one second because we decide this fading to be one second. So let's just connect this here at the completion. We want it to open up the next level. And the duration, I want it to be, for example, one second or 0.8, I think is more than enough. You can just put one that you put in here, in here as well. So no, let's just compile, save, run or game. And by the way, this game that you can see here, we did design it inside our course in Udemy. And you can have the links to, to, the, to our course in description down below. If you hit play now, you see when we go to our collision box, it fade out. And after 0.8 seconds, it go to the next level. Okay, we can change this to one in here and that's that maybe it is better. So again, let's just run. So no, let's just go to our collision box. When we go here, it fade out. And after one second, you can see we go to the next level. So that was it about this video. I will see you in the next one. <laughs>